So good morning guys, what's up? Welcome to the first day of summer classes. But before I go and get my workout on, I wanna thank Rooted Rituals for sponsoring today's video and I will talk to you guys more about their brand a little bit later in the video. But here's a little sneak peek of some of the products that I'm gonna be showing you guys. These are awesome for hair growth. Rooted Rituals is all about strengthening your hair and starting with the scalp. They're really helping me strengthen my hair, which I clearly need because I use heat on my hair all the time. So really quick, I'll point out the very obvious. I did get a new mirror and I'm so freaking excited. I was out with Chad's mom over the weekend. She had a couple of errands to run and she was in search of some things for both of Chad's grandmas for Mother's Day. And we came across this mirror and I just had to have it. It was such a good deal. I found it at Kirkland's. I don't know if I can link it, but I will look and see if it's online. It's a really big mirror. So I'm super happy that I found it. And I gave my old one to Chad's mom because she was looking for a small one for her bathroom. So it just really worked out. But here is the gym fit. I'm just wearing my Invigorate sports bra by Lululemon. And these are the Lululemon lemon align leggings in the 25 inches and they're in like this charcoal gray color and then i'm just wearing my white adidas swift run sneakers and we are ready to go get our garage workout on this is another one that chad got from the app that the crossfit place he goes to uses they always have like different workouts for you to do at home so this one's gonna be pretty intense so this means as many reps as possible <laughs> so in 10 minutes we're gonna do these three as many times as possible but chad's gonna do burpees over the dumbbells which is really really intense i wanted to do donkey kicks because i really want to work on my booty so i just subbed this out for me um and then tabata i don't even know what that is <laughs> he's gonna explain it to me but we're doing um alternating lunges chad's gonna do jumping i'm just gonna do alternating lunges i don't like to do the jump because it hurts my knees and i just don't want to like you know kill myself and then the third round is goblet squats um 20 and a quarter wait what 21 and a quarter goblet oh squat. 21 and a quarter so you basically like go down into a squat but then you only come up halfway and then you go down a little bit more and then that counts as one so it's intense and then 30 second rest bulgarian split squats 60 second rest and then the 200 meters is like the lap that we usually call like a lap so we're just like running down to the end of street and back it's about 200 meters and i got my music going you can't hear it because i don't want to get copyrighted chad is making what are you making oatmeal oatmeal oh i'm gonna make some eggs some scrambled eggs and i'm also gonna have a protein smoothie so i'm gonna make a blueberry banana smoothie and i have never done this before i just really want to use these blueberries before they go back so i'm gonna probably use like half of this and a banana almond milk and then of course my protein from milani new so i just put some ice in here because i'm not using frozen fruit and so it won't be very cold so here's my blueberry banana smoothie absolutely delicious as always and now I'm gonna make some eggs. I literally just squirted egg juice all over myself. Do you see this? Mm-hmm. How did that even happen? Anyway, continue cracking my eggs here. That's for you. Oh my gosh. I'm making a mess. There's okay. there's egg juice on the ground now. Okay. You should probably pick that up. I know. I'm using this as a whisker because chad put ours in the dishwasher so i have to use this which is actually supposed to go to a mixer but it'll work it all does the same thing after all why'd you say i put it in the dishwasher like that's abnormal well i never put it in the dishwasher i always wash it by he hand. put a dish in the dishwasher <laughs> But I, I like to hand wash things like that, so that's why I was confused. Maybe I didn't hand wash it. Maybe it's just, you, you didn't find it. No. Okay. 
So now I'm just gonna eat this yummy breakfast and Chad and I are gonna plan out our meals for the week. We have to go grocery shopping later today and then I have my class at like 12.30 so I need to shower and get ready for that. So it's a little bit later now and obviously I took a shower and threw some makeup on and I'm dressed in a nice oversized t-shirt. My lab is about to start in about 15 minutes and I'm not expecting it to be very long at all because my professor said that we're not really doing any like lab work. Basically the entire lab experiments are gonna be, um, they're not even gonna be like online simulation. They're actually just gonna be like, we're gonna read through the lab manual and pretend as if we were doing it. So we're just like imagining it and he's gonna give us fake data to do like our data analysis with. We're not gonna have like a physical lab notebook. So we're not gonna have like pre-labs and stuff to do. So that side of it is kind of nice because the pre-labs always took me forever. Uh, so I'm kind of looking forward to that, but I do have a lot of work to do actually. This first lab experiment looks like it's just going to be predicting products and talking about like what kind of chemical reactions form. So we're going to have to do like complete equations, full ionic equations and net ionic equations, which shouldn't be bad because that's chem one and I already know how to do that. So luckily, uh, at least we're starting off with something I know, I guess. I'm burning my nature's wick candle and it is the most peaceful thing in the world. It smells amazing. It has three different scents as it burns. So right now we're on pineapple tangerine, then it'll be tropical mango and mandarin berry. And it seriously just makes my whole room smell so good. And it's like the wood wick. So it just sounds like a little fire. Okay. So my lab just ended. It was on canvas conference. So instead of being on Microsoft teams, like everything was last semester, it's the same kind of principle. It's just on canvas, which is like the software that my my school uses for all of our homework and stuff so it was on there and luckily we don't have to show our webcam uh, I was kind of worried that he was gonna make us like have our webcam shown but he said that that's optional so we can just type in the chat box to like participate so I already started on the first experiment and um, basically he's gonna give us like these printouts every week and we have to do all of the work for it which I already did took a good chunk of my time but i got it done um and then we submit this on canvas i'm not finished i still have to do this part but i thought i would show you guys how i'm going to organize this because i want to make sure i have access to all of the work for each experiment so i am going to have a little binder here and i thought that i would just put each the work for each experiment into a clear protective sleeve and just keep track of it that way so i just put experiment one i'm going to put all of the papers that for that are for experiment one in a clear sleeve and just put that in my binder so that way anytime i need to refer to an old experiment i just have it organized like that Thought I would show you guys what I'm having for lunch because it's so delicious. It's a Greek pasta salad that's from Publix and it's just amazing. Feta cheese, garlic, basil, spinach, noodles. Um, there's like olive oil and I think red wine vinegar it said. It's so good. I'm trying to catch up on my water because I am behind on my water. And of course I am starting the dreaded Mastering Chemistry. It is back again. I knew it would be but I was just enjoying my break of not having to do Mastering Chemistry but here we are again. So I am just working on this now. This is like the intro so it's just like not actual chemistry right now. You're just having to like prove that you know how to type things and it's just so annoying because it's just time consuming and I want to actually get into the real homework so yeah, I'm gonna get through this. Let's do it. Okay, so it's a little bit later now and I thought since I am literally dying for a break from chemistry, now would be the perfect time to give you guys my little hair update. So if you guys watched several vlogs ago, I dyed my hair darker, so most of you guys already know that. And the reason I dyed my hair darker is because I am really trying to grow my hair out and take better care of it. I want it to grow longer, thicker. I want it to just be healthier in general. So that is why I wanna introduce you guys to Rooted Rituals, the sponsor of today's video. They have some really awesome products for scalp health to help you grow your hair. For whatever reason, when my hair is darker, it literally just feels healthier. I know it's just a color change, but it has something to do with the added pigment in your hair strands that just makes them have more strength. Shockingly, I've only been using their products for a few weeks, but I have seriously noticed that my hair feels so much 
thicker. And if you've been following me for any amount of time, you know that I love trying new hair care products. I'm always constantly switching up the products I'm using. So when Rooted Rituals reached out to me and said they want to work with me, I was very excited because I've never worked with a brand that actually wants to promote your scalp health, which is obviously so important if you're trying to grow your hair because it grows from your scalp. So I'm going to start out by showing you guys two of my favorite products from Rooted Rituals. And the first one is literally just a hair scalp massager. This thing is amazing. If you're someone who likes the feeling of someone rubbing your scalp, you need to get one of these. I literally made Chad massage my scalp for like 30 minutes with this because it's so relaxing it will put you to sleep. But not only is it super relaxing, but it promotes blood flow and circulation, which is super important for your scalp in order for your hair to grow. So I think that this is key if you're trying to grow your hair. Scalp massaging every day is super important for your scalp health. And theirs is designed to be used in the shower with this clarifying shampoo, or you can use it outside of the shower on a dry scalp, or my favorite way is with the cooling and strengthening tonic. The cooling and strengthening tonic is their signature hair treatment, and I love it. You just separate your hair into sections, you put a few drops in throughout your scalp, and you massage it through, and it gives you this immediate cooling effect and revitalizes your scalp, so it promotes hair growth, which is the key here. It has ginger root and vitamin E. I've been using mine every single day to maintain thickness, strengthen my hair against any damage because we know I like to use heat products, and it improves the scalp moisture barrier over time. Rooted Rituals has a whole line of products, but the last thing I wanna show you guys is their hair mask. This one also has ginger root and vitamin E, and of course, all of their products are safe on color treated hair, which is very important for me now that I am color treated. This stuff smells amazing and I like to use it in place of my conditioner. So if I'm gonna exfoliate my body or shave my legs, I will put this on right beforehand and just let it soak in all the moisture in my hair while I'm shaving and exfoliating and then rinse it out at the end. That way while you're in your shower doing your regular stuff, it has time to soak in. And I wanna thank Rooted Rituals again for sponsoring today's video. I am so excited to use these products to help grow my hair out. If you guys wanna check them out, there'll be a link in the description. Be sure to check it out. They have a whole line of products to help you revitalize your scalp and strengthen your hair so that you can grow it longer. way later now I did not vlog anything except for me playing Animal Crossing and then I ate dinner but I didn't vlog that Chad and I had salmon for dinner it was so good we had salmon green beans and rice but now I'm getting ready to take my makeup off and do a face mask and just wind down for the night I have done a lot today I feel like I kick-started my summer classes and I'm gonna go ahead and continue vlogging this week and show you guys, you know, how I am getting through pretty much the next six weeks of an accelerated Chem 2 course. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video and thank you again Rooted Rituals for sponsoring. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in my next video.